What's good, everybody? This is Kunal, represent KP Fitness. And um, before I get into the video, as usual, I just want to touch on a few quick uh, things before I show you all the workout itself. So today we did um, a pretty advanced chest workout. Went ahead and did uh, mostly incline movements. As you all come to know, I really do, I'm a big fan of incline. I always work from my upper chest down. Except for today, um, I started out with six sets of bench. As you'll see, and then I went on, the rest of the exercises were incline. But, so, as you see, we still got nine sets of incline in there compared to the six sets of flat. I don't usually do decline. Um, sometimes I'll throw in some chest dips, but that's it. I, I usually don't decline bench or uh, dumbbells or the hammer strength machine. So, like I said, it's a pretty advanced workout. Again, there's 15 sets chest. We went pretty heavy on them, too, pretty intense. 45, 60 second breaks as usual. I usually don't like to rest any longer. If I rest any shorter, I'm too tired. And um, I, I'm pretty sure I did in the voiceovers, but I got my wisdom teeth out yesterday, so bear with me if it's a, if it's a little bit unclear. Um, it's just because I got my wisdom teeth out, and I apologize for that. But enough talking, guys. Here we go. Here's a good video. All right, guys. So we kicked it off with uh, six sets of flat bench. The first few sets we um, warmed up pretty light, maybe 155, 165. And as you can see, these are later sets. Nick got um, 205 for four reps here. We didn't want to go completely to failure. I went ahead and went a little bit lighter, only 185. Um, I got five easy reps, and this is my sixth set. So I know next time that I'll um, go a little bit heavier on that. After that, we went ahead into the incline dumbbell press. This is my favorite chest exercise. You guys will see some videos on it, why um, I like it so much. And we went a little bit um, higher in reps, more in the muscle building range of uh, 8 to 12. Now, I don't go all the way down, and as you can see, I don't lock out at the top. I try to keep that constant tension. I went ahead and showed a different angle for you guys so you can see how low I'm going. I put in slow-mo too. So you can see I come up, I don't lock out at the top, and I come straight back down. It's a little bit hard like that, but I'm a big fan of constant tension. So then we went into the incline hammer strength machine. Um, Nick likes to keep his elbows a little bit more tucked in and keep that constant tension like I was talking about. You can see he's not even coming close to locking out before going back down and exploding up. And this is the last exercise we did. As you can see, um, we focused a lot on incline. Uh, once again, I'll do a video on then why I like incline movement so much, but we did some dumbbell incline flies and we went pretty high in the reps we're going for um three sets of 20 here so you can see i i like to get a nice deep stretch at the bottom and stop with the dumbbells about right in front of my shoulders i don't like to come any more in than that i feel like it takes attention off the chest so go ahead and try it and let me know what you guys think and as always don't forget to comment subscribe and like Email me all your training and nutrition questions. Email in the description below. And go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter, guys. Links in the description below as well. And have a happy new year.